All of this rain this week won't help. The intersection at Medicine Lake Road and Winneka Avenue has had major flooding issues for years. Reporter Meredith Hackler shows us how the cities of Golden Valley, Crystal and New Hope are all working together to stop the chronic flooding issue. You know, when it rains a lot, you can see how some of your projects are working. And so we got to see this project in action. While flooding near Medicine Lake Road and Rhode Island Avenue has gotten better, there's still more work to be done. New Hope, Golden Valley and Crystal are working together to fix the problem. The three cities got together to study the flooding issue and try to come up with some solutions. And the, the cities, what we came up with was a long-term flood mitigation plan that includes several capital projects to help create flood storage and lower flood levels, thereby reducing the risk of flood damage in this area. What you see here is phase one of the mitigation project. The city added this flood storage area along with closing off a portion of Rhode Island Avenue. The idea is to create uh, areas for the water to go, flood storage, and then to release that water slowly downstream so that you can reduce flooding. And that's exactly what phase two will do. The first and second project will tie into each other and work together. So a large box culvert will be create will be constructed between the two areas. Flood storage will be created um, and excavated behind us on uh, in a permanent easement dedicated uh, by the Dover Hill apartment property owners and and on a portion of the Pennsylvania Woods nature area around Decola Ponds B and C. And while the project will help residents in the area have a better quality of life, it will also benefit the environment. We'll be excavating and creating a water quality pond, and so that'll help clean and treat the water before it's discharged downstream. So that's a big benefit. Um, we're also going to be moving some of the uh, invasive species like buckthorn. In Golden Valley, Meredith Hackler, CCX News. Construction on phase two of the project will start in the fall of 2019 and wrap up by the summer of 2020.